Yeah, that's a, that's a very uh, interesting uh, application. Uh, how exactly do you do this uh, practically? Do, do you do your, your shoulder arthroscopy, and at the end of it, you um, inject uh, your uh, hyal... Yep. I don't you. think I'll ever be able to pronounce <laughs> that. <laughs> took, took me a few years as well. Um, <laughs> H-A. H-A. Yeah, right. Um, H-A. Okay. <laughs> um, yeah, um, yeah. At the end of the procedure, we you know, squeeze out what fluid we can and then through the scope inject it and keep your fingers on all the portals for a minute to stop any escape. Um, and, and that's it. Yeah. Okay. There was some concern some years ago about uh, steroids. You know, some, some people would inject steroids and then it, that led to problems and there have been uh, infections, there have been problems with tri uh, legal issues. Uh, do you think uh, HA would have the same sort of a problem? Or no, not? Not, not at all. I think from in many respects we know that steroids are proteolytic, whereas this is the exact opposite. Um, uh, and steroids are very, very short-acting uh, and wear away very... So although it's a strong anti-inflammatory, it only lasts a short time. This, again, uh, lasts a lot longer as well as having all the other biological benefits. With regards to athletes, um, you need a therapeutic use exemption forms for injecting steroids, plus you worry about the problems to soft tissues from the steroids. Whereas with uh, HA, um, you can use it. You don't need therapeutic use exemption. So it's particularly for, for athletes, I find it particularly useful. Any questions to Professor Funk? Any side effects you know of? No, I think there was side effects, local <laughs> inflammatory side effects, if you inject them into the soft tissues, particularly with the animal... Um, protein derived ones uh, but that's less so with uh, like the synthetic ones like viscosil and ostinol so we've not seen anything like that no not at all because it's a completely natural substance okay so if there are no more questions I would like to uh, wrap up this uh, symposium thank you very much TRB Comedica and uh, thank you to the speakers to Dr. Jost, Gazieli, and Funk, who uh, gave you a very good overview of uh, shoulder surgery as it's done today. Thank you very much.